Look at your loyal, goofy, couch potato of a dog. Now, picture a fierce, wild wolf. Think those two have much in common? They do, but it's not the wolf that became the dog. It's the dog that chose us. Stick around. Around 15,000 to 40,000 years ago, as early humans settled and created waste heaps, a unique opportunity arose. Some wolves, less fearful and more curious than their packmates, started scavenging near these human settlements. These bold individuals weren't captured and tamed. They chose to live alongside us. Over generations, these less aggressive wolves thrived, passing on their tameness genes. This wasn't just about behavior. It triggered significant physical changes. Their skulls began to shorten, their jaws became less powerful, and their brains even shrunk slightly. This is known as the domestication syndrome. It's a powerful testament to how selecting for friendliness can quickly reshape an entire species. This is how the scavenger at the edge of the camp became the incredible diversity of dogs we know today. Subscribe for more.